Ibrahima from Guinea. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Wa alaikum assalam wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. May Allah bless you, Sheikh. And you as well. I have a question related to Khiba, Sheikh. Uh, recently, a man here was caught about to rape a woman. He already had taken off the clothes of the woman, but she shouted and another man came, so the culprit like fled. Yet people know who it was, and it is said that it was the second time trying to rape someone in the vicinity. But nobody has like tangible proof. Does that become a khiba if we are warned or warned about that individual without tangible proof? The culprit is still free, as I heard, probably because there is no proof to lock him up with. First of all, if this culprit was seen to have tried to commit such a felony and a sin and a crime, the woman cried and there was a witness testifying that he was about to do his thing, but he was pre uh, prevented with the grace of Allah Azza wa Jal. These are circumstantial evidences. We cannot accuse him of zina because he did not commit zina. And we don't have the four witnesses to prove it. But we do have ample proof to slander him in the sense that he attempts to sexually abuse women and harass them. And there are two women who had set te uh, testified and filed a complaint, therefore warning people of what he had done based on these complaints that are official and registered. And he had not challenged these complaints in court or defended himself. This is permissible to warn people from, and Allah knows best.